So the average UK home looks something like this diagram. Um, and you can see most homes have probably had their cavities done. So that's that, that very slim line in the walls. Um, so that's cavity insulation. Most homes will probably have had their windows replaced at some, some point. So probably looking at um, a double glazed window system. Uh, most homes typically have the ground floor uninsulated. So either suspended timber or a concrete floor. Um, so that's currently currently not insulated. Um, a lot of homes also have a, a chimney. So whether that is a blocked up chimney from a previous um, fireplace or or sort of still in, in use as part of a um, sort of stove setup. And a lot of homes will have some sort of um, loft insulation. So that doesn't necessarily have to be in the slope. That could be horizontal, but that's sort of um, in general terms where most homes are. So you haven't got a continuous layer of insulation. This yellow line is, is not continuous. There's no continuous or designed air barrier in most homes. There's not much control over ventilation. So ventilation increases and decreases depending on um, things like the wind, the weather, um, and, and so the, the type of construction that you're looking at. So you've, you've typically got a patchwork design of new and old measures. They haven't really been holistically thought out and just added at various stages of the existence of that building. So that is typically the starting point. Um, sorry, wrong direction. And what an efficient home looks like in comparison. So this um, diagram was pinched by me from the Passive House uh, website. Um, the concept is basically a continuous yellow line continuous layer of insulation, a continuous designed air barrier, which is the red line to the inside of that. You typically have um, a very um, airtight shell envelope that is then controlled by mechanical ventilation. And that me mechanical ventilation system ideally um, is combined with a heat recovery system. So um, those are typically called MVHRs, so mechanical ventilation with heat recovery. And they just um, ensure that um, incoming cold air is, is warmed by the sort of warm exhaust air in, in a nice and neat process. Uh, so this holistic strategy is, is where everything is, is interlinked, thought out, um, and measures um, um, support each other. So it's, it's, it's more of a holistic approach um, um, of a, a low energy building. <clears throat> 